This is gonna be a quick video. I just pulled up at the gym. So today what I wanna talk about is when you have a situation with another man, you know what I'm saying? So it's like you and, you and another man, y'all are arguing, right? And y'all are having an altercation. Um, this, this sucker, he don't really agree what you're saying. He's saying, nah, man, we gonna do it this way. You like, nah, we gotta do it this way, my way. And y'all arguing and arguing and arguing. And this guy starts to disrespect you. So we're in a situation with a man, you know, man to man. And you are disrespecting. You guys have an issue with each other. Either one of two things are going to happen. It's either you are going, you, you guys are going to talk it out like civilized members of society or like Michael Max or whatever, or no, wait a minute. I don't think that was Malcolm X. I'm getting it mixed up. Anyways, there was one guy who said no, no violence and stuff like that. <laughs> Y'all think I'm tripping for this. So, or you got a second way. Y'all two will basically resort to vi to violence. You know what I'm saying? That mean y'all gonna throw hands. Y'all gonna fight. You gonna, you know, put your dukes, dukes up and everything. You know what I'm saying? So, in this situation, when you have an issue with an, with another man, you know what I'm saying? Especially when this guy, he's running off at the mouth and talking and talking. He's running his mouth. You, you know, you wanna, you wanna give him a, give him a quick jab to, you know, jab in the face. You know what I'm saying? Give him a, give, give him a left hook. You know what I'm saying? Left hook that man, right? As you want to do, man. You want to give him a left, an uppercut, man. You want to, you want to, you want to, I know, I know that's what you want to do. I know that's what you want to do. That's what I wanted to do also. Sometimes we get, we let our emotions, not emotions, but I ain't going to call this emotions or emotional because at that point, somebody is disrespecting you. You know what I'm saying? And you want to stand up for yourself and defend yourself. You know what I'm saying? And we let that basically make us do things that, that we're going to regret because there are people that you're going to want to choke you know you're going to want to choke you know choke the shit out of them you know what i'm saying you want to just get over here get over here bro get over here nigga like bro you're going you, you, I, I, that, that's what you're going to want to do sometimes you know what i'm saying you're going to you're going to have those moments but in those moments we had to realize if we let our actions you know what i'm saying if we let if we let the things that we want to do and we, we actually do it we, we choke somebody out we potentially harm someone or kill them we can go to jail we can catch, catch a charge you know what i'm saying we can have something on our record that is going to affect us negatively in life so a lot of times you'll have somebody who has nothing to lose at all there's people out here they have nothing to lose and they don't care if they go to jail Stay away from people who don't have anything to lose or they don't care if they go to jail. They don't care if something happens to them because they don't care what happens to you. They could have a not, you don't, number one, number two, if you're in a street fight, you know what I'm saying? This is valuable info, valuable information. If it is a street fight, you don't know if they have a knife. You don't know if they have gang members with them. You know, you don't know if they got they go get their homies to pull up and pop, 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 pop on you. You know what I'm saying? You don't want that. You don't want that type of smoke. You know what I'm saying? I wish people could just fight fair and, you know, throw the deuces up, but people are not going to fight fair. They're going to do whatever they can to bring you down and take you down. So the best, the best case scenario, the best way to handle an altercation, a, a situation is to walk away and remove yourself from the situation because people are ruthless. You know what I'm saying? Walk away, remove yourself from the situation. Brother, I don't agree with you. And I want to keep myself, I'm going to refrain myself from doing something that I'm going to regret. So I'm going to walk away and leave the situation, remove myself from the situation. And if the, if, 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 if the motherfucker, if the guy, the nigga, if he still keep pressing you, keep pressing you, pushing you, pushing you, come here, brother, come here, bruh, come here, bruh. You ain't gonna do nothing. You ain't gonna do nothing. They keep hitting you and uh, 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 poking you, poking you. You smack the, you, you smack the crap out of them. You smack the crap, you smack the crap out of them and get out of here. You know what I'm saying? 
if they, they, they keep, they keep, you are just going to self, you're going to defend yourself, right? You're not going to beat somebody up or harm someone. You're going to defend yourself. You're going to defend your family. You know, you're going to defend your, defend your woman, your children. You know, you're going to defend yourself. Make sure they are safe. That is the point of this. Defend yourself so you do not get killed out here. This is some valuable information. You know what I'm saying? I actually had a situation like this. It happened to me yesterday. You know what I'm saying? Where I had an altercation with someone. And, you know what I'm saying? And they, and, and, and you know, and, and I was, you know, we were like right here. And also pay attention to someone who's talking that smack. Rawr, 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 you know what I'm saying? And they and they and they literally looking the other way. Rawr, rawr, bro, I'm 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 behind you, bro. You 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 looking down. Why you why, why you looking at the ground and talking this smack? Hey, I'm I'm gonna beat your ass. I'm gonna beat your ass and you looking at the ground. You know how silly that is. When somebody is has an altercation with you and they can't look you in your eyes, they they are intimidated by you. They're intimidated. Then when the person starts looking in my eyes, see, I'm like a dog. You know how you, you're not supposed to look dogs in the eyes? You look me in the eyes, I feel like you got a problem with me. You know what I'm saying? So that's when it's like kind of square up. You know what I'm saying? So do your best. Try your best to stay out of these situations. Stay out of these, 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 these petty ass altercations and situations that don't deserve your time. It is not worth your energy because you are better than that. You are better than that. There's a higher power that is helping me to constrain myself, you know, and, you know, control myself, you know what I'm saying? And the people around me, you know, because truth is, if you're watching this video, you have a future, you have a purpose, you have a calling in life, you know what I'm saying? You have great opportunities. You have things that, um, you have things that you want to, uh, um, accomplish in your life. And, there are people who don't have a life, you know what I'm saying? Then they want to steal yours, you know what I'm saying? So it's all it's always like, uh, why don't you just um, why don't you get somebody um? That's what they do. I'm about to go into the gym. They gotta be right, you know. I, I drunk coffee. I ain't finished it all though, but um. I'm going to throw it away because I don't want no coffee breath. You know what I'm saying? When well, I got to speak to somebody and something like that, you know that coffee stains your teeth and all that. So um, I'm going to try to drink some water. But, um, but yeah, I mean, yeah, when you, you know, when you, uh, you know, you have a calling in life and God is here for you. You know what I'm saying? You have something to offer. You have value. Don't lose that value because someone else want, doesn't have any value at all on this earth and they want you, to take, like they, they want to take you down. Some people will do that. They'll try their best because they know they don't have anything going for them. Yeah. And this is some, I think it's some very valuable advice. You know what I'm saying? Um, I'm just passing the word. You know what I'm saying? You know? So, yeah, I hope you found this video interesting. If you are new to the channel, go ahead, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, and never give up. Your younger self is rooting for you. Peace.